Good morning, everybody. This is Subby at Subby's Weather Talk. Thank you guys so much for those that attended the Severe Weather Seminar last night. It was a great time. It was had by all. We had a little fun. We had a couple little glitches on, on our presentation as far as trying to get the slides to go back and forth. But uh, luckily, I had my son Remington there to uh, help save the day but it was a great time great turnout so thank you guys very much i just want to do just a brief video here this morning just a little bit of an update it's easier to show you than what it is to try to put pictures online in our facebook group so this will be just a short video what you're looking at right now is the model description of what we've got coming at us today it is going to be very wet as you can see this is currently we do have some showers and a few rumbles of thunder out there currently as we go through the course of the day you look off to the southwest and the thunderstorms grow numerous in west central missouri as we go through the day now we are not under any type of risk for most of West Central Missouri as far as severe thunderstorm potential. However, parts of St. Clair County, Vernon, Bates County, they are under a marginal risk to see a few isolated severe storms today. Now, I will be keeping a close eye on this. Over the last 24 hours, the Storm Prediction Center has moved that risk a little bit further to the north, encompassing a little bit more of West Central Missouri. So we will be watching for any kind of uptick in the threat for severe thunderstorms. Now, as we go through the afternoon, you'll notice just more and more thunderstorms will begin to fire up again in West Central Missouri and heading down into southwest Missouri and you notice a few of these little isolated storms here with some darker richer bold colors these are the ones that do have the potential to produce some large hail maybe some straight line winds but the biggest threat today will be for large hail golf ball size or larger so that is what i will be keeping my eye on for most of the day another threat we have is going to be for heavy rainfall if you notice the next 48 hour forecast for rainfall totals looking anywhere between two to three and a half inches of rain throughout west central missouri so it is going to be a very wet next 48 hours i will be monitoring the creeks and rivers around West Central Missouri for the potential to hit flood stage by the end of the weekend. But for right now, we can just expect some rain and thunderstorms, most of which will stay below severe limits. Now, there might be one or two stronger cells that could produce some penny-sized hail, but for the most part, I'm not expecting much in a way of severe thunderstorms here over the next 24 to 48 hours so thank you guys very much have a fabulous thursday and again thank you to all who showed up last night for a severe weather seminar at the vincent center everybody walked away with some weather radios and hopefully some valuable information so uh, be paying attention for some more pictures and memes as we celebrate the third day of storm season awareness week in kansas and missouri yesterday we had the tornado sirens go off uh, testing and i do believe there was one or two that maybe had a couple problems out there so this is the reason why we do this to get all the kinks worked out so that when the Time comes for those sirens to blare. We will not have any problems. So that's what the drills are for. They're to help us plan and to prepare. So as we head into the rest of Storm Awareness Week, I will continue to post some pictures, just kind of a refresher on some storm safety because we are heading into what seems to be a relatively active 
severe storm season for West Central Missouri. Have a great Thursday, everybody, and I will be talking to you soon.